Hello mate, where have you been? I've not seen you for days. Are you hungry? Right, come on then. This is how close I can get to him, he's literally less than a foot. Good God, for the second time this week, I'm running for a train. I should be used to this by now. Um, my van's not ready and all the car places are closed after quarter to four, quarter to five. So I have to leg it to catch a train to then leg it to the car hire place. I'm too old for this. Oh. Deja vu. Turns out that my bag was open. Bugger. At least my iPad didn't come out. Oh Christ. This is like the world's worst version of Challenge Annika. Oh God. Okay. Ponty print. Okay. One way. Single. Huh. Thanks for reminding me. Confirm. Pay. Uh, Okay, I apologise for the audio quality, but here I am again at the train station. The reason is, is because I got this text message and it doesn't look like my van, well, it's not going to be ready today. It's gone from needing one wheel bearing to needing two wheel bearings and brake lining, which I'm not so sure about because I've had both of my back brakes replaced. So it's going to be expensive. Now what I should have done is stuck with my original plan of going into Cardiff on a Wednesday, picking up a car on a Thursday, then I haven't got to worry about any transport, my van is my hotel, and then on Friday I could leave at a sensible time to get home. But no. So if you haven't watched the last video, uh, they said that they might be able to get it ready on Friday. They promised me a text message by midday. That hasn't happened. And thus, finding out an hour pretty much before all the local car hire places closed, I have to run to the train station, as you've just seen, get the train, and then leg it for 15 minutes to try and get there before 4.45 to pick up a car. Why? Oh, why? Do I do this to myself? And if things weren't going calamitous enough for me, uh, I, have I mentioned that I've run out of data as well? Uh, I don't know what's happened with doing these videos, but uh, I have gone through my 12 gig of data somehow. I wonder if, oh, I know why it might, because I've done the photos thing in sync over mobile data. Well, this could lead to a nice little smarty review. Oh, so I'm going to get to Pontypred and then I've got a rough idea where the garage is. Oh joy. So another update. It's 15.53. The Ponty people called me back to say that they definitely haven't got any cars, despite the woman on the phone saying that they had. And she's in, the only person in the office and there's nothing she can do. So she's put me through to the branch in Murphy. They said they have got a car, but now I've got the thing, my next train isn't for, isn't until 1637. So a good 40 minutes away. And they close at five, but they said they'll hang on for an extra half an hour till I get there. But there's a mile and a half to cover when I get from the train station. I would have got more B-roll then, but I've got to run back to work because people leave work at four o'clock on a Friday and I'm hoping to get a lift. But why, oh why, did I not stick with my original plan of getting a hire car on Thursday morning? And, oh. and of course, it can't just be one wheel bearing. Oh no, 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 it's gonna be two. 
And if I'd have known it's going to have two, I would have taken in my blimmin uh, suspension I want to put on it and got that done at the same time. But uh, uh, I've got to call them in a minute, so I'm going to get into the office, see if anyone is going my way, and go from there. I am so looking forward to a beer, gin and tonic, wine, everything. 16.22 and I managed to get a lift and I am here at Enterprise and I'm hoping that car there might be mine but in black uh, I managed to get a lift so a small saving grace but I just really want to get home now I'm tired uh, and the garage asked me to call me back said they'd, oh, they'd already spoken to me and I went no they haven't they said oh we sent you a text message and I'm thinking to myself, well, that's not exactly the same as calling me, is it? And as I said, if I'd have known, I would have got the springs done to lower it down as well. But here we are. I shall update you when I am in a car. At first thought, this looked tempting, and then I saw what was in it. Doesn't look too bad, but it has that thing in there. Trust me, you do not want McEwen's export. I had thought about getting this, but then I checked out the price. £2.56. Come on, focus in. But I feel today we might go a bit different. Behold. I know I'll get mocked for this. <laughs> but this will do me. Gotta be said that Morrison's pizza range is a little bit disappointing. But that'll do for tonight.